So tell me about like everything that's going on right now in music. What are you most excited about? I'm excited about tonight. I mean, the Clive Davis party is always like a huge thing. And I heard a little birdie whispered in my ear that Public Enemy was playing. And it's like, it's about to be an election year. This is a very political band. So we're all kind of getting souped up for it tonight, I guess. And then, you know, I have to ask you, right on the Kelly Clarkson show the other day, JT was talking about you guys were in the studio. So are we going to get something after Better Place? We might have another one after Better Place. Um, we might have been cooking a little bit, just a little bit. Oh, man, can you tease something? What's, what's the tracks like? How are you feeling in the studio with them? Um, look, every, every time we get together, it's always a good time. So, um, and there just seems to be that thing. When our voices come together, uh, it's, there is that element. I know it sounds cliche, but it's like as if we never left. So um, it's fun to hear the records when we hear them back as well. It's like when you're working, you're just focused on the work. It's the listen back that you're going, there it is. Oh, wow. Okay, there it is. And then you're also working with Liam. So how is it to work with another boy bander and you guys have this single coming out? Let, let me, uh, first of all, it's Liam's song. But I have to tell you, it was so fun working with him. He, you know, it's a, it's a different generation and there's a, a totally different energy. Uh, he's totally locked in on what he's doing and he was very focused about what kind of music he wanted to make. And uh, so working with him was an absolute joy. I have to say, Liam was a wonderful person to work with. We can't wait to hear the track. I love you so much, JC. Thank you. you. As well, man.